Our history is just one part of our state that makes it so unique and beautiful. And Route 66 is a big part of our history. Keeping that stretch of historic highway beautiful actually takes time and quite a bit of money. So that's why a small cafe was honored for making sure that it did its part in making an iconic symbol along the drive stand tall. Patrick Hayes takes us there. You've probably seen him from time to time. A tall lumberjack, Paul Bunyan, with an ax in hand. He's perched 25 feet above the ground on top of May Cafe off Louisiana and Central right on Route 66, an Albuquerque landmark. Lumberyard. This used to be a lumberyard, so years ago. And for those who know the history, they say it represents the food May Cafe has to offer. I don't know whether you know the story of Paul Bunyan, but he was a, supposed to be a tall, good man. And this is how I look at the food. It's, it's excellent. The food is excellent. So maybe Paul Bunyan is shining down and saying they're going to give you good food. But to get the statue shining again, it took some work. There was a lot of wear and tear. And for a while there, he sat armless. Every time I would drive by and see him missing his two arms from the elbows down and his axe, it was, um, it was really sad. So the owner of May Cafe did something about it and had the tall Albuquerque staple restored. And today he was honored by the New Mexico Route 66 Association. Today we honor the Wynn family and the May Cafe for the investment and personal restoration efforts in reviving the lumberjack man back to his original earlier glory. May Cafe was given the Route 66 Heritage Award. It lasts me long, so another 50 years, 100 yeah. years from now. Yes, <laughs> hopefully. Yeah. Patrick Hayes, KOB4.